we did. The judge said that he would issue that ruling uh, by 5 o'clock this evening. Of course, now it's 6.01, and we are still waiting on that ruling. We were told at one point today that it may come just later this evening, but I was actually told in the past 15 minutes or so that a formal written order not going to come until Monday. Of course, this is the case that we've been watching so closely. It's about Governor Kevin Stitt's decision to have Oklahoma stop accepting those extra unemployment benefits from the government, the federal government. Back in June, Governor Stitt said he was concerned that those extra weekly benefits were motivating people to stay home instead of going back to work. Instead, he offered a $1,200 back to work incentive. Then this lawsuit came about arguing that the state uh, was actually required to stay in that federal program. Uh, arguing that the governor just doesn't have the power to opt out of that program. Lawyers for the attorney general's office saying yesterday that actually they believe the governor did have the power to get out of that program. Uh, we are now waiting for that decision. Either way, the judge has a lot of options here. He could order Oklahoma to opt back into that program. He could say, actually, yes, the governor, uh, it was up to him to get out of the program. Or he could leave it up to the Oklahoma Supreme Court to make that decision. As soon as we have some details, we'll keep working our sources and checking with the court. As soon as we have any details on that, we will bring that to you. But the latest news that we've heard is to expect an order on Monday. At the Capitol, Dylan Richards, KOCO 5.